The startup world isn't known for quiet beginnings, but H, a Paris-based company founded by ex-Google employees, managed to take things to a whole new level. They announced a $220 million seed funding round last year before releasing a single product. Just think about that. $220 million with no product on the market. That's not something you hear about every day. Then, not long after, three of the five co-founders left, citing operational and business disagreements. For a moment, it looked like the kind of turbulence that could sink even the most promising ventures. Despite the shaky start, H kept moving forward. This week, they introduced their first product, Runner H, and it's already turning heads. Runner H is built for what H calls the agentic era of AI, where machines aren't just reactive tools, but autonomous problem solvers. This isn't about following step-by-step -step instructions. It's about planning, reasoning, and executing tasks in ways that save time, cut costs, and open up new possibilities. Runner H is powered by H's proprietary compact models, which include a 2 billion parameter language model and a visual language model, VLM. These numbers might seem small compared to something like GPT-4's 175 billion parameters, but the results tell a different story. Runner H's models outperform many larger competitors in efficiency and accuracy, especially in practical and real-world applications. This is a big deal in an industry where the trend has been to throw more and more parameters at a problem, often at the cost of efficiency. Runner H is already making an impact in areas like robotic process automation, quality assurance, and business process outsourcing. Robotic process automation has been around for years, but it's often limited by rigid script-based tools that break whenever systems or templates change. Runner H handles these shifts with ease, automating repetitive tasks like recruitment and onboarding with a single prompt. This cuts down processes that typically take weeks into moments. Quality assurance is another area where Runner H shines. Testing websites and applications is a tedious, resource-intensive process. Runner H automates it, handling tasks like simulating user actions, checking page availability, and ensuring compatibility across payment methods. It adapts seamlessly to changes in user interfaces, allowing developers to focus on innovation instead of constant debugging. Um, business process outsourcing is another space where Runner H is proving its worth. Billing workflows, especially in industries like dental insurance, can be slow, manual, and reliant on third-party companies. Runner H automates the entire process, from fetching insurance plans to analyzing and submitting claims, giving businesses control over their operations and reducing delays. The technology behind Runner H is backed by solid benchmarks. On Web Voyager, a test that evaluates an AI's ability to navigate and interact with live websites, Runner H scored 67%, beating competitors like Anthropic's Computer Use at 52% and Emergence Agent E at 61%. What makes this even more impressive is that Web Voyager uses live public websites, so the performance isn't just theoretical, it's tested in real-world conditions. Uh, Runner H's visual language model, the VLM, is another standout feature. It excels at interpreting graphical user interfaces, images, and diagrams, as shown by its performance on the ScreenSpot benchmark. This test evaluates how well a model can understand and interact with graphical interfaces. Runner H's VLM outperform much larger models like GPT Furrow and Pixel Large from Mistral. It's fast, efficient, and accurate, proving that bigger isn't always better in AI. The language model, HLLM, forms the backbone of Runner H's capabilities. It's designed for high-level decision-making and programming tasks, and its performance on benchmarks like Human Eval and MBPP demonstrates its strength. These benchmarks test a model's ability to generate and execute code, and HLM's results show that it's not just a strong performer, but also efficient and adaptable. H has been strategic about rolling out Runner H. A private beta is now open, giving developers access to APIs and H Studio, a tool for monitoring and editing agent performance. Right now, it's free to use, but a pricing model is expected to roll out soon. The beta isn't just about testing the product, it's about gathering feedback from real users to fine-tune the system. H has already been working with customers in sectors like e-commerce, banking, insurance, and outsourcing to refine Runner H's capabilities. The vision for Runner H goes beyond the web. CEO Charles Cantor has spoken about universal automation, 
where AI agents can navigate any graphical interface and perform tasks autonomously. This is a long-term goal, but the initial focus on web environments allows H to demonstrate the technology's capabilities while building toward that larger vision. H's journey obviously hasn't been without its challenges. Losing three co-founders early on could have been disastrous, but the company managed to stay afloat, thanks in part to its strong funding. Since the initial $220 million raise, H has added another $10 million, bringing the total to $230 million. This funding includes contributions from high-profile investors like Eric Schmidt, Yuri Milner, and Xavier Neal, as well as strategic backers like Amazon, Samsung, and UiPath. The backing of these heavyweights underscores the confidence in HH's approach to AI. What sets H apart is its focus on compact, specialized models rather than large generalist ones. This strategy isn't just about cutting costs, though that's a significant advantage. It's also about creating AI that's efficient, effective, and tailored to specific tasks. In an industry where bigger often means slower and more expensive, H's approach is refreshingly pragmatic. So, H's compact models aren't just theoretical innovations. They're delivering results in areas that matter. Whether it's automating tedious workflows, streamlining QA processes, or enabling businesses to take control of their operations, Runner H is proving that small, focused models can outperform larger ones in the right contexts. The launch of Runner H marks the beginning of what H calls the agentic era. This isn't just about improving productivity or cutting costs. It's about redefining how humans interact with machines. By focusing on autonomy and adaptability, H is setting the stage for a new kind of human-machine collaboration. The potential applications for Runner H are vast. From automating hiring processes to handling complex billing workflows, the technology is already showing its value. And with plans to expand beyond the web, the possibilities are only going to grow. Runner H is essentially a statement about what's possible when AI is designed with efficiency and adaptability in mind. H's approach challenges the assumption that bigger models are always better, proving that specialized compact models can deliver exceptional performance in the right contexts. Uh, as Runner H moves from private beta to broader availability, it will be interesting to see how it evolves. The initial results are promising, but the real test will come as more users put the technology to work in real-world scenarios. For now, Runner H is a strong contender in the race to define the next era of AI. With its focus on autonomy, efficiency, and practical applications, it's setting a high bar for what agentic AI can achieve. All right, let me know what you think in the comments, and if you enjoyed this, make sure to like and subscribe for more AI updates. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.